Hey everybody, welcome to Don't Starve. I'm finally back from vacation, so it's time to record another video. For those of you who don't know, which is probably like no one, this is the game that won the uh, vote for which game I should play next. So I'm playing it. And uh, yeah, I've played this game before, it's awesome. Um, my plan is I think I'm going to play uh, until I die. So that should be a pretty obviously nowhere near as long as Minecraft because if I die in that one I'm going to keep playing but um, in this one if you die I'm pretty sure you can't keep playing unless you've done a certain thing okay then <laughs> Ooh, don't give me this lag. I just started recording. I'm trying to upload a video in the background, so it might be making this one lag. Oh, okay, better get rid of that. Uh, all right. So basically, what I want to do to start is just grab as much crap as I can fit in my inventory, uh, and also make a campfire how you survive. Because uh, in this game, darkness is your absolute enemy. If you're in darkness for, like, too long, which isn't that long at all, then you'll straight up die because some mysterious thing murders you. Which sucks. Especially if you're getting murdered. Alright. Let's see. Got a bit more grass. Uh, alright, how much stuff do I need? What do I need to make the campfire? Alright, I need two logs to get that in to cut down a tree. Okay, so I need... Oh, whoops. Uh, I'm used to other games where I escape does something different. Um, I need twigs, so I need to... It's all piney. Also, this game's awesome because it has a lot of, like, uh... It, it seems to have a lot of inspiration from, uh, Tim Burton style stuff, which you can probably tell, um, and it's just awesome, it's a great game. I'm gonna stay, oh, yes, oh, <laughs> dude, alright, let's see, oh, there's some more seeds, you can toast and eat those, uh, so in this game, for those of you who don't know, you have to, uh, survive as long as you can, uh, which in part means you have to uh, keep your sanity, which is the brain, and hunger, which is the stomach, obviously, at as high as you can. Like, basically, if they get to zero, then you'll start dying. Uh, which may happen. Who knows? Uh, many different ways you can die in this game, so... Uh, come on. Let me get the... Oh, right. Also, you can change the camera angle if I can remember how, but... I can't. There we go. Give me that carrot. How much time do we have? Okay, still enough time. Just grab as much crap as I can. Oh yeah, okay, so I can make an axe now. And a pickaxe. Which I'm gonna want for stuff later. <laughs> I haven't played this game in a little bit. I, I know it's very hard to tell, but it's been a, a little while. Yes. I think that means now... Yes, I can make a campfire. So once it's night time, I can make one of their campfires. Yeah, this game's super awesome, and uh, it has a really cool art style and stuff. These ones are still growing, so I'll let them grow, because I need... I need a... See if I can get this guy. Oh, I got him! Damn! Usually you can't just, like, straight up kill them. Normally, uh, you have to, like, set a trap for them. Ugh, I keep doing that before it's time. Have to wait until it happens. It's good, there are a lot of resources here. I should... Okay, it's... It's, uh... Getting to night time. So, 
Gotta grab the remaining stuff before I make my fire. What I need is more food, I think. Damn. <laughs> um, I can eat flower petals, so I guess I can always do that if I'm really desperate. Um, but I've got some food here. I can roast it and it'll be better. Just hoping to find some kind of, like, berry bush I haven't picked yet. This one's good for chopping. chop down. Awesome. Okay, it's getting closer to night time. Real quick, I think I should have enough time to mine one of these golden ore rocks. Sweet. If I get 12 rocks, then I can make a fire pit, which, uh, when it, when the fire goes out, it doesn't disappear, and you can use it. Ooh, it's getting close. Okay, I better make the fire. And that will be my base for the night. Uh, yeah, I'm really excited to, uh, I have a bunch of games I want to play. Uh, can put that on the floor. Uh, yeah, I have a bunch of stuff I want to play. And, uh, it'll be awesome. I don't want to say specifically, because I don't want to give it away, but it's going to be super cool. It's a good thing I already have an amassed collection of awesome games <laughs> that I can play on YouTube. Because, I mean, obviously, I play video games outside of YouTube. So, oh, you know you run out of things to say when... Oh, yeah, you gotta scare these birds away. Sometimes they drop seeds. And it's nighttime. So you can kind of see if you leave this circle, like, of light here, then you'll get straight murdered. Putting stuff on the fire. All right, what can I make? Ooh, I can make a science machine, which uh, ma lets you make more things. All right, let's build it here. So while I'm near this, I can make more stuff. Like, uh, I don't know. I can make more than just the axe and the pickaxe. I can make a luxury axe out of gold and stuff. But oh no, I can't. <laughs> but I know I can now. I need an alchemy engine for. Oh, gotta keep that lit. What can I put on? What can I put on? Uh, Alright, fine, stick. Oh, I should be using uh, logs. Awesome. Oh, I need to eat. Okay. Great. Awesome. Perfect. Now just gotta hang out. Alright, let's see, what about structures? Hay walls. Cut stones. Yeah, because you can like build a kind of like forts kind of thing. Sweet more gold. Ooh, path. Okay, so the thing with paths is that uh if you follow them, sometimes they lead to villages of pig people, and, uh, pig people, uh, I actually might build a uh, base near them if I can find a village, because they, uh, they kill monsters and stuff that come near them. Uh, so that's awesome. Oh, yeah, um, sorry, I don't have the, uh, I had an axe. That was... Okay. Whatever, I can afford it. Um, I don't have the newest DLC, which adds uh, giants, which as you can guess are just these like, giant things. They're these giant monsters, and they're super cool. There's like a tree one and stuff. Um, so maybe 
Maybe if you tell me in the comments, and I know that people will be interested in that, then maybe I'll buy it. I have videos of that. Oh, okay, so these little pond things have these, like, nasty frogs near them, and they'll, like, steal your items and stuff, and they suck. Branching path, branching path. They seem to be the same path, actually, that just connect and leave you in the middle of nowhere. That's cool. I didn't want to go anywhere, like a pig village or anything. <coughs> oh, sweet. Okay. <gasps> oh, awesome. Okay, so this thing, uh, what it does is, uh, yeah, you get it, and then this guy, Chester, shows up, and he's your little pet, and you can put stuff in him. So you can hold this, and yeah. And he just follows you around. He's awesome. All right, come on, show, show them you following me around. Yeah. That's the thing he does. What pawns. Those two overlap. Okay. You can probably see that yourself. I'm just, uh, not that used to... Oh, I'm just not that used to, uh, you know, talking constantly while I play video games. Because, uh, I mean, obviously, normally I'm just sitting here and playing the game silently. Because no one's watching me. At least I don't think they are. Ooh, they're always watching. But, uh... <laughs> It's super cool. It's, it's really fun to do uh, YouTube stuff, which I talk about a lot. Again, because don't know what to talk about. Seeds. That's nice. I can talk about that. All right, I've run out of things to talk about. Oh, sweet berry bush. this. Oh, what is, is this like a farm? There's a metal potato thing. I want it. I've never seen that before. All right, well, maybe I can set up my base near here, and I can just use this farm that's already set up, because I'm pretty sure there's like a bunch of work involved to, oh my god. <laughs> Sorry, that's my friend. Probably gonna start messaging me now. Ooh, shut up. Oh crap! Okay. Uh, sweet. I can build a fire pit. Awesome. Finish doing this farm. This is great. Just great. And yeah, a lot of things can kill you in this game. Um. Okay, real quick before it's nighttime, I'm gonna cut down this a few trees. So I can have some fuel for the fire. Grab that, grab that. Alright, I still have time, I still have time, I'm good. Still have time to cut this down. Probably didn't actually have to set the fire up then, but whatever. Do -do 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 -do. Uh, those of you who do know about this game, uh, maybe you can tell me whether I should do more magic stuff or more science stuff. Because, uh, you can do, uh, maybe, I don't know, I haven't, I haven't played, like, very far into this game, but I know that there's, like, uh, branching paths of magic and science that you can do. So, uh, those of you who do know about this game should tell me, uh, which one of those to focus on. Ooh, that's a roaring fire if I've ever seen one. Ooh, grab it quickly. Ooh, carrot. I have enough time to grab that carrot. Oh, danger. <laughs> danger carrot. Alright, well, I found the episode name. It's Danger Carrot. You'll know that already because you're watching this episode. That, or I'm just gonna call it something else to, I don't know, troll myself. Or what, I don't know. But probably this will be called Danger Carrot. Oh, 
Oh, uh, yes. Alright, now all I have to do is hang out for a little while. I'll be fine. Oh. Man, this sure is good footage of me eating. Oh, man. Aw, oh, Chester's taking a nap. Wake up! Alright, what is this metal potato thing? This metal potato contains great and fearful power. I can't tell if you're joking or not. Because when you examine stuff, there are, like, some of them are, like, jokes. Not that one. Not that one. That one doesn't have a one. <laughs> not that one. Yeah, see? Cut grass, ready for arts and crafts. I can't eat it, but it sure is shiny. That one's not good. So you see what I mean? But, like, that's not even... I can't tell if he's joking or not about the potato. Because it could. It could have great and fearful power. Oh! <laughs> well, I should have been watching my timer. It looks like this episode is almost 20 minutes long. Uh, I'll just call it a special kickoff episode. So, thanks for watching, you guys. I appreciate it. And, uh... Like, comment, and subscribe. Bye!